Welcome to Wappler, the visual web app creator. Wappler includes a robust and complete set of server-side tools. We're going to introduce you to them in this video. The Server Connect panel is where the server-side tools are located. To open this panel, simply click its icon. When you first open this panel, it may tell you that a server model hasn't been specified. This is no problem. Just click the Project Options button and this will bring up the Project Options dialog. The Server Model options are available in the drop-down menu for Server Model. As you can see, Wappler supports not only PHP, but ASP.NET and Classic ASP also. One thing I love about Wappler is that it offers a visual way to create complex server-side workflows. First, we simply add a server action and give it a name. This 30,000 foot view really shows how much power Wappler has just waiting to be tapped. You can define your get and post variables here as well as sessions, cookies, and even your server variables. Action forms can also be imported here so you can use those in your workflow as well. Steps is where we can define the steps that need to be executed. Looking at the dialog, you can see that there are many actions available here. There's data validation, database actions, image processing tools, file and data management, and much more. Just like adding elements to your page, Wappler has all server-side actions smartly categorized based on what needs to happen. In the database action category, you can see that there are many options available. You can create complex queries, insert or update data in your database, and far too many options to name. In later tutorials, we'll show you how to use all of these tools, plus much more. Here's a quick example to show you just how easy Wappler is to use. By clicking the Query Builder button, it brings up the Database Query Builder. Now, simply choose your database table and select which columns you need. It doesn't stop there. Wappler also allows you to set conditions for your query up here on the Conditions tab. For every condition, you can add both static and dynamic values. What's even cooler than that is that you can even see the complete SQL query being generated at the bottom of the dialog box. That's just the tip of the iceberg. You can also set simple or complex sorting options for your query. Just add which column you'd like to sort by and choose the sort direction. Consider that we just created a complete database query without writing a single line of code. And better yet is the fact that this is just a microscopic example of what Wappler server-side tools offer. Stay tuned for our next tutorials where you'll learn how to use these tools to create complex actions and build your own CMS using them.